Hey, it's Russell Holly with Geek.com here. We've got the HTC One, the Samsung Galaxy S4, and the Google Nexus 5. 3, 2, 1, go. How much faster is that Snapdragon 800 processor in the uh, Nexus 5? We're going to go ahead and find out here with Qualcomm's performance evaluation game, Reign of Amira. It was built specifically for Snapdragon processors. And so we're going to go ahead and take a look and see what needs to be done uh, you know, to determine you know, which of the phones is the fastest. Now both the uh, HTC One and the Galaxy S4 are running Snapdragon 600 processors and the one in the middle here, the Nexus 5, is running a Snapdragon 800. And As soon as you start the game, uh, you can see that the Nexus 5 pulls ahead very quickly, loading the game much faster than either of the other two phones. Uh, you know, going straight to the, the play scene here. And we're actually going to skip this scene here because there's actually another loading sequence afterwards. Um, so we're going to skip them all at the same time and you can take a look and see, uh, you know, the, the loading sequence will happen again and the Nexus 5 pulls ahead, uh, you know, just as it's expected to with that faster processor. Uh, so as you can see, if you're going to play games, you will see a, a performance increase between these three phones, but you're probably using your phone for a lot more than just playing games. Um, so we'll take a look at one or two other things. Reign of a Mirror, by the way, is in the Google Play Store. Anybody can install it and check it out. It's actually a pretty fun game. We'll go ahead and move on to loading the camera app, which is uh, kind of surprising. The camera should move pretty fast, but as we go and see, uh, the Nexus 5 is actually the slowest when it comes to launching the camera application. Um, and we'll actually do that a second time to, to make sure that there wasn't uh, operational bias there, some accidental slip of the finger. We will, uh, we will load the camera app with each one of these three as close to it at the same time as possible, um, but we got the exact same result. You go ahead and tap, and the Nexus 5 is the slower of the three devices to launch the camera application. Now, it's one of those things that you only really notice in a side-by-side, -side, but it's definitely slower when you put them there. We'll go ahead and do a browser test real quick just to wrap it up. Head to geek.com, and as you can see, everything loads real nice, uh, and it's just a subtle difference. The Nexus 5 pulls ahead. Thanks for watching.